What's going on you guys? Pet Platypus here and today I'm going to be reviewing Toriko chapter 354. Although there's really not much to say about this chapter. Uh, it's little testicle monsters going to attack Toriko and Starjin. Their demons come out. They do this epic fucking like volcano fire jet fork and send this thing flying into space. But it straps itself down. It's able to pull away from the fork and come back down. And then the Wolf King's just like... like he just... He just sniffs, and then this thing just, like, drops dead, or something, and then he stomps on it, and this is the moment where it's just like, where's Saitama at? Like, Saitama or Wolf King fucking, like, Genis, like, who wins that fight? Like, Saitama One Punch Man caved Baldi versus Eight Kings fucking Wolf King Battle Wolf Genis. Like, that's a fight right there, because he stomps. And, you know, you see the shockwaves, and you're like, okay, I saw, uh, what, what was his name, uh, Gao or Go or whatever, the, one of the four beasts, he did something similar, but then it shows, like, the horizon line and, like, the side of the planet, and you're like, oh, fuck, it's gonna get fucking stupid right now, and <laughs> the ground starts rippling, and the whole landscape and continent, and, like, there's this massive explosion, and Toriko and Starjin were gonna get thrown, like, hundreds of thousands of kilometers or whatever, and even though they held themselves down, they still got pushed back like hundreds. And they're like, what the fuck happened? Or they know what happened, where they're like, where the fuck is the horse king? And he's taking a piss, which is awesome, because he's a dog. And then he just blitzes over there, takes out Starjin before you even know what's going on. And then Toriko gets taken out, and that's the end of the chapter. And I know that was like a really long explanation, because I went like play by play. But it is an extremely simple chapter. There's like... Two attacks, three attacks delivered, I guess, if you want to count the fucking sniffing, whatever the fuck that is, what what he's sucking out of them, their souls or something, I have no idea. But, like, I don't even know. Like, the horse king, or not horse king, um, wolf king, did I say horse king before? Uh, at any point, I do apologize, that was stupid of me. Um, the wolf king, Genis, the battle wolf, so savage, like, his design is savage as fuck, the stomp was disgusting. Like, literally, and it was just a stomp. Like, I don't even know how much effort he put into it. Like, think about if Saitama, you know, because you see the serious punch against Boros, it's like, could the Wolf King, because I don't know what Saitama does later. Maybe Saitama does even more ridiculous shit in the manga, but, yeah, Wolf King, damn, like, ridiculous. Saitama versus Wolf King, that should be a fucking death battle on Screw Attack. <laughs> um, and there's no way a planet's surviving it. That's just, that's that simple, but... Uh, yeah, I'm really not talking about the chapter much, or actually reviewing it, this is more of a ramble, because, like I said, there really isn't much to say. Toriko mentions that, was this creature really so strong that our gourmet demons had to come out and fight for us, and he says something like this has happened before, and he recalls a couple of moments, but that's really about it. That's the only non-action-y thing that happens, and everything else is just what I already mentioned, so I could literally end this review now, I mean... What happened was disgusting and epic, and like on an entertainment, from an entertainment perspective, I guess this chapter was pretty high up there, like a solid 9, 9.5. It was some crazy shit, but it felt short. It felt like it was three pages long. It just didn't feel like a full chapter of Toriko, especially after so long that we haven't had one, at least I think. I could be wrong, but I feel like over the holiday break and everything, we didn't get much uh, Toriko, so. Yeah, I feel like this is the first chapter in a while. It's definitely the first chapter I've reviewed in a while. It might not be the first chapter in general in a while. But yeah, it was, uh, the art was good as usual. You could tell what was going on. Um, unless you really weren't supposed to, you know, like with the sniffing. I don't think you're supposed to know what's happening there just yet. But yeah, uh, the art was great. It looked badass. Um, it was paced well. You know, you go from page to page. It's a really fast-paced chapter. Like I said, it feels very short. So I guess the pacing kind of works against it, maybe. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I uh, I liked it. I, it's hard to like call a, call this a review. It's hard to like give this chapter a rating because it is so quick. Um, unless I'm just like completely blanking on other things that happened, I'm pretty sure that's the whole chapter. So yeah, I don't know. I liked it. Um, it won't say I loved it. Uh, I loved parts of it, like the one step, but still, like, one step wolf versus one punch man. Like, seriously, like, 
Because I, I think about that after seeing, like, Saitama and, you know, One Punch Man ended and everything. And I'm like, yeah, he was so strong and that was a serious punch and he, like, split the clouds and everything. Then I see this shit and I'm just like, who the fuck would win in that fight? Um, man versus Beast. I don't know, but fuck it. Um, it is kind of weird how this review is more about that than the actual chapter. But again, there is not much to say. So I'm just going to call it a review before I ramble too much longer. I liked the chapter. I'm curious what you guys think in the comment section below. I'm not going to give it a rating, but I did like it. And uh, who do you think would win? Saitama or Wolf King fucking Battle Wolf Genis? And uh, yeah, thanks for watching this video. Tell me what you guys think of this chapter of Toriko in the comment section below. Follow me on Instagram and add me on PSN. I'm Peplotipus on both. Give this video a thumbs up. That would help me out a lot. Subscribe if you haven't already or if you like what you've seen here. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.